What is jailbreaking? Simply enabling application side loading in unofficial ways can be called as jailbreaking a device. The tool created to achieve that in Windows Phone is the Zapload Unlocker created by Fadil Fad so huge credits to him. As the former name suggests, the tool will enable both developer mode and interop unlock. But why you need to do this? To explain in depth, all the official methods to sideload applications into Windows Phone 8.1 is now dead along with the store shutdown which took place in the end of 2019. Due to that, by default, Windows Phone 8.1 devices are just stuck with what it has, nothing more. That is why this tool is created as once applied, you will be able to sideload unlimited amount of supported application packages to your device. When considering the requirements and supported devices, any device which can access mass storage mode is supported by this tool thence by this guide as well. The usual way to activate mass storage mode is to unlock the device bootloader, so if you don't have mass storage mode, then you have to unlock your device bootloader. That is all for the introduction notes, continue on if you wish to proceed. So, let's download Zapload Unlocker. You can download this tool from the developer's GitHub page easily. The link is in the description. All you got to do is to go to releases and download the latest one available. Also, you can download Zapload Unlocker from our repositories in Windows Universal Tool application as well accessible via the displayed path. Once you get it downloaded either way, you can proceed to the next steps. I have moved the downloaded Zapload Unlocker to my desktop. Let's start to jailbreak our device. First connect your Windows Phone to your PC. Then, open Windows Phone internals. It will display the device details. Click on the manual mode entry from the left side menu. Then click on the switch to mass storage mode text. Now your phone will automatically reboot out from the OS and then will boot to mass storage mode. Once the device successfully boots into mass storage mode, minimize Windows Phone internals. Run the downloaded Zapload Unlocker executable. Beware that some virus guards may flag this as malicious and may prevent you from running this tool, this is false positive. If this happens to you, you should unflag this or temporarily disable the virus guard in your PC. The unlocker will automatically detect the main OS partition of your device. Leave the unlock type to all unlocks. Now, this checkbox is a choice of the user. If you did check this and unlock, the jailbreak status will not go away if you do a hard reset. But if you did not check this and unlock, the jailbreak will go away if you do a hard reset. It's better to check this box so I will do it. Now, press the unlock button and once it's grayed out saying unlocked, the jailbreak is applied. All left to do now is to boot out from mass storage mode, which you can do by simply performing a soft reset, hold both your volume down and power buttons until the device vibrates. Once the device has been booted successfully into the OS, you can enjoy sideloading any supported packages to your device. As a test run, I will show you sideloading a new application package to the device. As you can see, I have my device already connected. Let me deploy 8-zip application package to my device. Deployment is complete and as you can see, 8-zip is now in the apps list in my device. For application deployment to Windows Phone 8.1, you can expect a new video guide soon which will feature the complete process and instructions. 
So, that is how to jailbreak Windows Phone 8.1 devices. Goodbye for now.